This is called Bubblegum. It is Proven Winners Petunia. And it is a bit... I got a little leaf there. It's a bit of a thug. I mean, it is very prolific. You can see how well it grows. I have this little pot here. It's probably a three gallon pot, but you can see it really, really blossoms out pretty well. Now, I planted this guy. This is uh, Priscilla. This is a Proven Winners, but I planted it at the same time. And you can see it's about a one foot diameter. And that thing is like a three foot diameter. That thing's like a three foot diameter. There's, that's one. That is one petunia. So, it's kind of overgrowing my hookeras, my mondo grass, which is growing on the edge, and, and my priscillas. I mean, it doesn't highlight my priscillas at all. I mean, it's crawling up into my cannas over there. So, I, I gotta cut this back. All right. a little better still got that big thug hanging but the uh, the ground is better I'll take this one out right here put it in a pot for the winter put it in my greenhouse I'll take this guy out and Priscilla I got about five or six out of that one and then I'm not sure what I want to do with this pot or these two pots over here. They're just not, they're not looking good. I put some petunias in here. I have one of these guys, but these guys are just not, I just don't like these petunias. Not petunias, I'm sorry, primrose. They just don't look good. Primrose. They're all yellow leaved and I don't know. I don't like them. And that guy right here with all this stuff, this has got to go. This stuff has got to go. That stuff is very weedy. I mean, you can rip it all out and next year you have just as much. just doesn't look good I can't put it in the compost though because I don't want more look all these little roots that's gonna just make more so 
I'll get rid of a lot of this stuff. For my fall planters, I gotta dig out my canna here that never grew. I mean, it just put on new growth, yeah. I got five or six new plants in here, but these things gotta go, I'll have to burn them. much as you can even if you got rid of all the green you would still get just as much next year that's the way they are so all these this hookah I'll have to yank this out it's got to be divided I mean there's probably five or six or eight different plants in there I could get over winter in the greenhouse so I got to yank that hookah out I mean look at this thing this is not pretty. The deer came in and they ate all the flowers off one day. So you just hack this thing back. Get rid of the stems. It's still, it's August. It's, we're going to get 90 degrees next few days, so it'll put on new growth. And then, what I will do is I will come in here, dig this thing up, and it'll divide into probably five or six plants. Yeah. For next year. I gotta get rid of these. These things. You could just cut these off. Get rid of these. All this. Now we'll put on new growth and you'll get new flowers coming out of this. So much work. But that looks good.